All right, hello. Uh, this uh, is a tutorial on how you can render uh, anime images. So to start off, uh, there, you see there's this white background. So if you use the magic eraser tool, it makes it really easy for you to just render images because it's just a white background and the uh, eraser tool would like remove the whole white background with just like one click. So there you go. So as you can see, the background has completely disappeared and except for a few exceptions because this is the line connecting it so if you click those they'll also like be gone and you have a you know, complete render it depends on how how you want it basically so you can save the image as a png you have to save it as a png you can't save it as a jpeg uh, to get the render so that's one way another way could also be you know the quick selection tool so you select uh, the entire like anime character you go through all the curls and stuff like you select like these you, know, you can hold you can click it doesn't matter and then you do a you do a layer cut layer copy this, this is how I do it and you see there will be some extra parts so you can like yeah you can use the eraser tool or if you want more detail you want it to be more detailed you could use the lasso tool but you have to be pretty precise la. Yeah, I'm not really very precise at this, so you can... You know, this, you, for this you have to be pretty patient, but yeah. You know, you can always adjust it on your own. It doesn't matter if you exceed a little bit or not. Let's go follow all the edges. Yeah, as you can see, sometimes it's not really perfect. So if you want like 100% accuracy, you use you can use the lasso tool. You know sometimes the quick selection isn't that helpful, especially on those uh, images with a lot of detail, a lot of curves. Pull the line, get it done with. You reconnect it, boom. Okay, it's not really perfect, but yeah, you can do the same. You cut thing, move, move the layer. Yeah, it's pretty much the same, except like a few parts here. So you can, like, yeah, like I said, do this. You remove it, but it depends on you. So if you take a look at this picture, it's there's a lot of detail. So if you were to use the eraser tool, you know, it doesn't really remove everything because uh, it's pretty really complicated oh. you can see you have to keep clicking and yeah it's, it's a pain in the ass so 
in this case you will you will, you use the lasso tool or the quick selection tool and quick select everything. I at f the first thing I did was to use the quick selection tool and selected most of it. Uh, there and then there's some extra background here. Like all this orange is all the extra background that I removed with uh, the eraser tool or with the lasso tool. Then I cut it and I get something like this, which is uh, good enough for me as a you know render image. Then you when you're done, you just save it as a PNG file. Don't save it as JPG or JPEG. Yeah, then you get your render image. Yep. So that's pretty much it. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. And yeah, thank you for watching.